Father, we thank you for loving us. Give us more grace to live for you and to glorify your holy name. In Christ Jesus, we pray. Our topic today Great men of God gone through trials to testimonies. These testimonies are the two books the Old Testament and the New Testament. The old testimonies and the new testimonies. These testimonies confirms that God loves his people and in trouble he sent them power. We are made known to be or to live alone. Because he owns us and he made us. That is why he made us that way. You cannot carry money you eat from now until when you die. And if you have it, you stop working. If you stop working, the development will stop. He will always send you this money in bits so that you continue working. You who believe in God, you must have a test in order to be examined whether you qualify or not. In that problem, there is a great testimony. Great men of God gone through bitter tests to reach their testimonies. They didn't withdraw. They asked for another body. When Sedak, Mesak, and Abednego went the fire, they did not extinguish the fire. They called another body which fire cannot. I'm reading John 14. Verse 15 up to 16. If you love me, keep my commandments. And I'll pray the Father, and he will give you another helper that he may abide with you forever. The Spirit of truth, whom the world cannot receive because it neither sees him nor knows him, but you know him, for he dwells with you and will be in you. I will not leave you off us. I will come to you. Say, Lord Jesus, you knew that I cannot manage. That is why you say that you ask the Father to send me the helper. Now this difficult, I cannot manage. Lord Jesus, You 
cannot manage. Matthew 28 And Jesus came and spoke to them, saying, Yesu Naja, Nagara Nabo, Nawakambanti, who are them? Let the message be directed to you. They needed the power. They got the power. They sat their test to testimonies. And you are admiring them. Just to show you that you too you should do the same. That is why we are here today. And they came and they spoke to me. Whatever the difficulty in your life, let it face the word of God straight. Don't say, and Jesus came and he spoke to them. Who are they? That message will never be yours. Take this message as yours. Can we read all together? And Jesus came and spoke to me, saying, All authority has been given to me.